This is video taken by Little Cottonwood Canyon, Utah, right over Route 210, which was actually closed yesterday due to avalanche concerns. You can see why Utah DOT had to close it. We had an avalanche, big chunks of snow, trees wrapped up in here, so the debris is quite large. And unfortunately, we're going to continue to see a high risk of avalanches because of the warming temperatures out west over the next couple days. Now, the direct west coast is going to stay on the cool side for Washington and Oregon, but we're talking about the south west through the Rockies, the Wasatch Mountains, the Bitter Roots. That's where our temperatures are going to be warm over the next few days. Billings, Montana, for instance, is 74 degrees. You normally don't feel those temperatures until early part of June. And so this is going to cause a little bit of concern when it comes to the spring melt. Denver, for instance, potential record high tomorrow of 84 degrees. That means up in the Colorado Rockies, yeah, it's fun to ski when it's in the mid to upper 50s and you can wear just a t-shirt. But unfortunately, it comes at a big risk when it comes to avalanche patrol. So make sure that you're staying within these marked territories. Listen to local officials. If a road is closed, don't cross through it because this warming air is going to cause a concern with the snowpack. And although we're getting a taste of it right now, this is going to become more and more of a story as we work our way farther into spring. Look at the snowpack here. I mean, Brighton, Utah, 743 inches. Jason, as we start to warm things up and all of this does melt, we will have to watch how that whole process takes place. Well, I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.